Mississippi, a family-owned craft store, could opt out of providing contraceptive coverage to employees because of their religious objection. Do you agree or disagree with this ruling? Should they be required to provide contraceptive coverage regardless of their religious beliefs? Well, first, I believe that uh, contraception should be available um, uh, and probably more broadly than it is today. I'll come back to that. The Hobby Lobby decision was not about contraception. It was about if a business, uh, if a private business decides to open business, they haven't suddenly given up their right to religious freedom. But let's get back to the, to the uh, contraception issue. I actually agree with the American Medical Association that we should make contraception more widely available. Um, uh, I think over-the-counter oral uh, contraception should be available without a prescription. If you do those kinds of things, you will actually increase the access and, and reduce the barriers for having more options uh, for, for women for comp contraception. Uh, Kay Hagan, I suspect, with the support that she's getting from the pharmaceutical industry, may have a variety of reasons not to take it from uh, behind the counter and put it on the counter. But I think that's something we should work together on because that's how you improve access and reduce costs.